Hey guys, so today I've got an unboxing video of my new 21.5 inch iMac. The model that I got is the higher end variant in the 21.5 inch iMac range. Apart from the iMac, I also did get a USB super drive, a magic trackpad, as well as an iPod Classic. Well, the reason that I got another iPod Classic is because the one that I unboxed and uploaded on my channel about 4 years ago, that iPod Classic is spoiled, so here's the replacement for it. It is still the same box, so I'm pretty sure everything inside it will be the same. I even got the same color. Alright, so I'm just gonna do an unboxing video of all the four items that you see right here. Let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so to open up the box of the iMac, first you have to pull this tab right here. Right, so the tab has been removed. Let's flip the box over and then just open it up like that. Should come out nicely. And yes, it does. Right, so... Right here, there is a box that says designed by Apple in California. And it should contain all of the accessories. And it does. I do have the magic mouse to the right. wireless keyboard as well as a box that should contain the quick start guide cleaning cloth and all that yep quick start guide iMac important product information guide Apple stickers as well as a cleaning cloth. Alright, so now that we've got all the accessories out of the way, let's just get the iMac out of the box. Okay, so on the back of the um, styrofoam, you do have the power plug. It is the UK version. Alright, so let's remove the styrofoam to reveal the iMac.
So that's my new iMac. Obviously the 21 and a half inch screen in front, iSight camera, Apple logo. Let's just turn it around. And we also do have another Apple logo right there. All of the cables are connected to the iMac behind. From left to right, you do have the headphone jack, SD card slot, four USB 3 ports, two lightning ports, an ethernet port, and lastly in the middle, the power port. So let's just take a quick look at the box. On the front, it just says USB super drive together with a picture of the device. Left and right sides of the box just has the Apple logo. Some compatibility notes on the bottom together with your barcode, serial number and all that. And on the back, it just has a picture of what the um, device does. Right, so once inside, we do have the super drive right on top with the USB connection. Put that aside and just a quick start guide and one year limited warranty um, booklet. So let's just take a look at the box. It does say magic trackpad in front, a picture of the device, Apple logos on the right and left sides of the box, just some compatibility notes down below with your barcode and serial number and all that. And on the back, another picture of the device. This is your Apple Malaysia service card and some gestures that um, you can do on this device. Nothing on top. So. I do have a pen knife right here. Let's go ahead and get started. Right, so upon opening the box, you do have the trackpad right on top. Put that aside. Below this compartment. Magic trackpad, this should be the um, quick start guide, your Bluetooth regulatory certification, as well as Apple One Year Limited Warranty. Alright, so let's just take a quick look at the box before we unbox it. You do have a picture of the device on the front. On the top, it just says 160 gigabytes. Also on the bottom, on the left side, a side profile of the device, on the right side, iPod Classic, and on the bottom, what's included in the box, compatibility notes, and your um, serial number, barcode, model number, and all that. Alright, so I do have a pen knife right here. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so right on top, you do have the iPod Classic itself, still with its nice shiny back. Let's put it aside, pull this tab out, put the tray aside, it does say designed by Apple in California right there, and right in here we should have your quick start guide important product information guide as well as a couple of Apple stickers. Also in the box you do have the USB cable. This is not the new lightning cable. It's still the old 30 pin cable so yeah. You also do have the earphones. Again not the latest earpods but should still work. 
in the old dock connector. Alright, so let's do a first boot up of my new iMac. All right, so let's just turn on the trackpad. All right, so it's now asking me for my language preference. And yep, English as my main language. I will need to turn on my keyboard right now. It should detect, yep, it has detected. I am in Malaysia. Continue. It is the US keyboard and my Wi Fi network. All right, so I've just entered my Wi Fi password. Just waiting for it to connect. Do not transfer any information now. Continue. And let me just enter my Apple ID. All right, so I've just entered my Apple ID and I've allowed my Mac to um, use the Find My Mac app. And now it's asking me for the terms and conditions. Uh, whoever reads this stuff, they eh? agree. And I'm just going to create this computer account. Alright, so I've just created the account for my computer. And it's asking me about iCloud. Um, I'll set up the iCloud keychain later. Continue. And register this Mac to my Apple ID. And it should be setting up right now. There is the video of my new IMAX first booter. Alright, so that's it for the unboxing of my new 21 and a half inch iMac. Just a quick recap on what's in the box. You do have the wireless keyboard right there, magic mouse, literature, power cable, and the iMac itself. Alright, so thanks for watching and goodbye.